Hey guys, um, I'm sorry, I'm just not, I'm, I'm sorry, I've just been, I'm sorry, it, it's, uh, it's difficult, I'm, I just don't want to talk about it, but I just, I just realized that it's been a year since my last cream pie. What? What? Hello, my bookworms. It is I, the worm that slithers into that hole and doesn't come out until it's satisfied. Zaby. <sighs> Anyways, queens, how y'all feeling? How y'all doing? I hope you're feeling good and sexy and oh, ooh, girl, I'm feeling it tonight. <sighs> Anyways, queens, for today's video, we are going to be watching a movie that I know nothing about. This is one of the rare videos, reactions, where I don't even look at the synopsis. I've seen the poster. I know it's two white women up in the poster. But that's all I've seen. I haven't seen the trailer. I haven't seen the uh, synopsis. I haven't seen anything. Other than the fact that back, 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 back a couple of weeks ago, I think it was over a month ago now, that when I told y'all recommend me some good movies once I'm done with the shows, that I'm gonna be like, movie. There were surprisingly a, a, a good amount of book smart, book smart, book smart, book smart, book smart. So I was like, okay, there's something to this, obviously. If there's, you know, people are like wanting me to react to this movie. So, um, I know nothing about this movie. All I do know is that I believe this is a comedy. Because, here's the tea. If y'all have seen the last couple of movies that I've been reacting to, and TV shows. <laughs> but anyways, queens, um, I don't want to waste too much time because, you know, a lady of the night can't stay in all night. Mm. But of course, I mean, if you enjoy me, if you enjoy my company on those lonely nights and you want to see, I don't know, see more of me, maybe go on a second date and see how it goes, then girl, why don't you just like, subscribe, and ring that <coughs> Anyways, queens, let's go. Take a deep breath. <sighs> Good. <sighs> mm. And look down at everyone who's ever doubted you. F those losers. Oh. F them oh. in their stupid f faces. Okay. Well, at least you're not bitter about it. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, the phone. Hey. 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 What? 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 Okay. Okay. What? Go white girl. Missed Go you. white girl. I missed you. I missed you so much. Been one night. Okay. Okay, okay, the, the rhythm is not there, but okay. As long as you got the spirit, bitch, come on. That's it, signing off. Go crack it! <sighs> Boom. Uh, mm. I remember so distinctly that I started to cream in my knickers. I could, I could feel it. I could actually... Mm, I just came in my pants, sorry. I need to go over the end of the year budget numbers we have. <sighs> I mean, why don't you do it with Nick, you know, please? Oh my goodness. Uh, Can't we just graduate, head off to college, you know, celebrate this wonderful achievement, and let's focus on getting through the rest of the day without any Ooh, mm, an older man with a beard, bitch. Oh my god. Baby, if he was my principal, bitch, I would have been featured in an episode of Law & Order. Electric chair. Hey. Hey. Jesus Christ. Oh. <gasps> No spatial awareness of this film. I think I know why you guys wanted me to watch this movie. <laughs> oh, shady bitch. Yo, yo, what up, Miss Fine? Just want to drop off a last day present for my favorite teach. Jared. What is Malcolm Moore doing up in this movie? Come on. Jared Bear coming at you from all angles, right? Little or me. Little baby Jared at the bottom. <laughs> baby Jared says, Happy graduation, everybody. Yeah, no one's going to wear a shirt with your face on it, Jared. Girl, not even Leatherface want to wear your face, on. Fair towns, people, I swear to God. <clears throat> I need this fucking shirt. Look at this shirt, bitch. We will be performing the Bart's comedies as modern tragedies outside Whole Foods across town. But it's actually funny. It's, it's what we did in my summer program last year in Barcelona when I lived in Barcelona. But did he live in Barcelona or was it Barcelona? I'm confused. I Bitch, now that he's at Barcelona, I feel like watching the Cheetah Girls part two. Amigas, cheetahs, friends for life. The rhythm in each other, that's what keeps us tight. Um, ciao. Anyway, so. All he wants to do is goof off, it's infuriating. 
Uh oh. Baby. Oh. Ooh. Oh, she's cute. Mm, how you doing? Am I a lesbian? I'm going. Just gonna. There she goes. Where are my lesbians at? I'm watching you. I see you. This is the content you want. Hey. Oh. oh shit. Sorry. Good. Sorry. Are you gonna come to Nick's tonight? His aunt went on a cruise ship that broke down. So Nick's gonna throw a party at her house. You know, they're stuck on a boat, shitting in buckets. Oh. She's got a really cute smile. She just seems like she'd be a really fun person to have sleepovers and lie around with. Pardon me, I'm a fun person to have sleepovers and lie around with. Well, with her, there would be more... Finger banging? ...vagina involved. Yeah, uh, yeah. That's fair. Mm. Uh, <gasps> not the cemetery or the penitentiary. I got money. That was a lie. Money. I got money. Bitch, not Billy Lord, honey. That, that, that every time I see her, I just think of Scream Queens. Uh, I mean, iconic show. The first season, not the second season. Don't watch the second season. Um, the first season is just so good. That was my that was my religion when that show was out. It, I didn't watch anything else other than Scream Queens. Up. Oh, if you've never seen Scream Queens, stop stop right now and watch Scream Queens, then come back. Okay. How did you graduate sixth grade? Shocking to me. So, okay, so. I can't fuck her, you know, because when well, I'm scared, my dick can't get hard. That girl is so weird. She always acts like she's like 40. Oh, God, this is awkward. Her vagina's probably stuffed with diplomas. How much you want to bet? Girl, you know the tea. You got to look under the stalls before you start talking about somebody behind their back. Who raised you? Oh, please do not stop on my account. While you guys were all studying AP hand jobs, I was kicking ass and busting curves. And I'm going to continue to do that at Yale. I'm going to Yale, too. Oh, um, Tanner, where are you going to school? Uh, I'm, I'm playing soccer at Stanford. Stanford University. <laughs> I got recruited to go code for Google. I mean, it's not... Oh, no. Well, that backfired. Hold up. You guys are serious? Mm-hmm. This isn't possible. You guys don't even care about school. No. We just don't only care about school. Ooh, crats. Ooh. You see, that's why you can't be assuming anything about people based on the way they look or the way they act, the reputation, honey. Because, you know, people look at me and they just look at me and they just think I'm just this ditzy, gorgeous supermodel with legs up to the ceiling and, you know, just this effortless beauty, this unattainable beauty. And they don't know that I'm just like everyone else. I'm just like a regular person. You know what I mean? <laughs> I do not miss high school at all. <gasps> Why don't you just pee on her? Like y'all have stepped on this bitch already. Like she is. Look at look at. She looks like about to kill somebody. Look at this. Show like one of the kids from one of the twins from from The Shining. I'm getting concerned, but to be honest, I'm getting concerned. This is fuck. Okay. All right, Trixie Mattel, stop with whatever this is. Let's go to Nick's party. Are you kidding? No, no way. Only we only have one night left to have studied and partied in high school. Otherwise, we're just gonna be the girls that missed out. We haven't done anything. We haven't broken any rules. I mean, I get it, because I was very much like a straight-A student. Like, I didn't fuck around in school. I didn't have sex when I was in high school, honey. I mean, I had sex outside of high school. I didn't have sex in the high school. I know some girls that were giving head up in the staircases. Yeah, honey, that wasn't me. I had class. Just saying. But I ain't judging. Who allowed you to be this beautiful? Who allowed you to be this beautiful? Who allowed you to take my breath away? All the Who paramedics. Nope. So who's Bonnie and who's Clyde? What is y'all wearing? Hand sanitizer. Chapstick. College IDs. Now mace. Condoms. Prep. Lubricant. You have the same part she does. You just take what you do to yourself, flip it upside down. Mm. Oh, what if I don't use my hands? You can make yourself calm using only your mind. Well, one time I got fucked so good that I came without my hands. I still dream about that night. Cause I'm dreaming <sighs> of you I once tried to masturbate with an electric toothbrush. I mean, I've sucked so many things up my ass. I mean, remote controls, bedposts, drumsticks, fire hydrants. Girl, please. I mean, I can't sit down straight anymore, but. I know what ecstasy feels like. Oh God, Tanner ate a ghost pepper. He needs milk. Someone get him milk. That's not gonna help. 
That don't look fun to me. You know what? You know what's fun to me? Having a nice warm bath, having a good hearty meal, taking a good cup of Zequel, and watching the Golden Girls until you knock out. Baby, you will dream and sleep like you've never had before. Now that's a party. And also you gotta add a melatonin tablet. Baby, you will be floating. But don't do this at home. I'm just saying. Don't come sue me, bitch. Jesus Christ! All aboard the SS lit! No meow. It's like Guy Fieri's wet dream. It's a means to an end. Ladies, we are headed to the biggest, coolest grad night party in town. Can I get a what? What? Oh, if we say we'll come, will you shut your ass up? Lean in. Women work. I have this thing where I like to hear the words of powerful women before I party to remind myself of the respect and awe you ladies deserve. Internalizing the revolution. I got pregnant with my first child. I'm gonna put some little Kim or something. Jared, it's fine. Isn't she like your girlfriend or something? What? No girlfriend for me. I can't pick faves. Too many ladies want to lock this down. Girl, too many ladies want to lock you up. Do I want to know what a kind of special thing is? <gasps> Oh, cocaína! I just just chill a little. We met to one night. So hot, so young. I'm not getting any of it. Sing to show us our joy. Girl, it's cocaine, not plutonium. That's my bad. <gasps> but we are here. What do we do? Don't move. Don't inhale. All right. Oh shit. <sighs> It's not drugs, that's just Gigi's vitamin. What, cocaine? Yeah, you know, like vitamin D, B12. Gigi likes to crush them up and snort them. She says they work better that way. What? Well, they do say that when you put a tampon in alcohol and you shove it up your ass, apparently it works. I don't know, that's what I've heard. I don't know. That was a lie. You're, you're serious, Jared? This is your party? You don't want to go to Nick's Lime House party. Come check it out for a little bit. It's sick. The catering company said it's the coolest party they've ever been to. Let's go. You getting excited? <sighs> Welcome to the club! Uh, Bitch, where the people at? There's not a soul here, Ames. Ice Tiger? Oh, no, ma'am. Girl, if the passengers from the Titanic had a choice to go to this boat, they still would have chosen to drown. Girl, what? <gasps> I'm so happy you guys are here. <gasps> here, drowning strawberries. Oh, no. oh, my goodness. Oh, oh, oh. Mm. 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 Ooh, a strawberry dipped in chocolate. Oh shit. Oh my god. You want? Oh, no thank you. Not a drug person. Not even pot? I feel like I could help you relax. Girl, horse tranquilizers wouldn't relax this one, honey. I lost my virginity in what I thought was a park, but it turned out to be a graveyard, and now the ghost spirits live inside my eggs, waiting to be reborn. It's not at all the same. I always felt like we were similar. God, I'm gonna miss you, come here. I take B12s, honey, and this will make me this crazy. We'll fight you to the death! Oh! Okay, I'm calling security. There's only one thing left to do. Oh my god. Jump. Oh, no, 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 no. This heaven have gone crazy. No, no, no. Jig? Jig? Jig, you okay? He's okay. Fail, fail, fail. Girl, marijuana don't make you do all this, eh? Oh my god. Oh my god, Alan responded. We have the address. Okay, I'm calling a lift. I'm gonna go home. But if you wanna go to Nick's, you should really go. Seriously, go. Malala. Who? You know you only get like one Malala a year. Yeah, I'm calling it. Oh, hell no. No. I'd rather walk. Yeah, and you're aiming. <gasps> Well, they don't pay that good in schools. Job's a good way to supplement the, uh, the old income. Yeah. You know, teacher salaries today and all. So. Oh, it's, so it's, a, it's a disgrace. Yeah, plus, I'm writing a book now. Oh. Yeah. That's nice. I mean, as sad as it is, I mean, I remember when I was in se seventh grade when I transferred here to New from New to New York. I don't know if, you, if any of y'all have done this, where y'all have to sell chocolates and see who sells the most chocolates and all that stuff, or charity, whatever the fuck. There was this girl that she was the smartest, she was the most determined, she was that bitch. She was, I know that she was gonna be going to Harvard or something. She was so smart, she sold the most chocolates, she was everything, honey. I just found out that she's on OnlyFans basically selling her cookies. Only there was just video. People looking up. Sorry, are you talking about? All I'm saying. No. No one would know if you watched one porn one time. All of those women are European trafficking victims. Excuse me, ma'am. Are you judging other people's sexual preferences? Because you fuck a panda every night. Oh. How have you never watched Porto? I mean, you don't want to see the things I see. Oh God. I mean, one time I saw Porto, a straight one, where this guy put his whole head. 
it was disgusting. I like honestly, Verizon called my Wi-Fi company to called me and they were like, "What the f are you watching, bitch? This is nasty." Do you have a phone charger? Oh, if you guys want to listen to your music, I can just plug it in up here. Oh no 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 no! no, no, no. Was that Cardi B? It was whopping. Oh, that is embarrassing. Oh. Lord of my body, damn! Damn, this is some scary shit. He's dead. He's dead. Who's dead? My husband. He's been killed. All right, Viola Davis, calm down. What are you guys doing here? What is going on? It's a murder mystery party. I've been planning it for months. Wait. This is your house, Alan. Alan, I was so clear in my text we were looking for Nick's party. Robert was an esteemed Broadway director and the love of my life. And he's been killed like a dog in the street. Does he stand? That sounds. Oh, she's going for the Oscar, honey. Why do gays love a murder mystery? I have seen just about every murder mystery film ever and I live. This is my ultimate dream. Now this is a party to me, honestly, instead of throwing yourselves off the ceilings to the pools and eating jalapeno chills and all that stuff. <laughs> You see, like the Mantis, we always get our man. Mrs. Peacock was a man? <coughs> the victim is here at this very table at this very moment. And so too, ladies and gentlemen, is the murderer. is beginning to resemble a mortuary. Don't touch nothing. <laughs> That's all y'all need. Do not go, Jeffrey. Oh, she's really good. Oh my god, you guys are here! What the f***? How did you get here? And how are you dry? How are you dry? Girl, I feel like I snorted cocaine. What is going on? You can't tell anyone. We won't. Not even each other. Okay. Nick's party is at his aunt's house. Hey, Amy, I swear to God, I need to get out of here. By the way, you're doing fantastic. What do you mean? I thought the strawberries would have hit by now. Oh. It's like ayahuasca, but Asian. Ayahuasca, bitch. I had a friend that went, I forgot where he went, that he went to go uh, do that ayahuasca stuff. He told me that he threw up and shit himself at the same time. I swear, I swear. And he said that he had this whole, uh, he was floating aside, like he felt like he was on another dimension. I was like, bitch, that sounds cute for you, but that ain't for me, honey. I like to be in control. I don't wanna, I don't wanna shit. I don't wanna pee on myself. I don't wanna float. No, ma'am. <laughs> Why do you look like that? Uh, Molly, you're a f doll. No, you're a f doll. What? Uh, oh my lord. Oh my god, don't look down, Amy. No, I, I, I can't breathe. I feel like I'm watching. Y'all remember that show? It was a celebrity match. Oh my god, that it was like a cartoon, like those mold cartoons that they would have different celebrities and they would fight each other. What is going on? I just need to be smooth and flexible. Look at you. Won't let you do this! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Fuck you, George. Molly loves Nick. Can you please stop repeating that sentence because it's not true. Yeah, Molly hates Nick. Thank you. She projects disgust to cover up a deep desire. No. No. Dude? Mm-hmm. No. Yes. I don't like it. Yes, you do. I totally get it. When I was in middle school and high school, there was these guys that would always make fun of me. They would always verbally abuse me, talk down to me, treat me like they thought I was trash, like I wasn't human, call me all kinds of names. But then when we were in the bathroom alone, honey, tch, the only abuse they did to me was to my hope. Oh yes, it's always the ones, it's always the ones that they're so pressed by your existence that when this, you know, private, it's a whole different story. Like why are you so pressed? What, what about me presses you so much, bitch? What is this? We asked the questions! Oh my God. You're just gonna give us the address to where you delivered some pizzas tonight. Bitch. Do you guys have a weapon? Yes. These bitches got hair covering the. 
Girl, Rachel Dolezal had a better disguise. I could have you across the state line in like 40 minutes, take you to some cabin, hog tie your ankles, leave you in a room with like a saucer of milk and videotape the whole thing for a couple days. Wait a minute, wait, what? What? That was very specific, sir. Whenever I see a man with those glasses in the 21st century, I just automatically assume that I've seen him in America's Most Wanted or something. Who walks around with glasses that, like, those like 60s, 70s type glasses? No. No. You caught a couple of bodies in your closet, bitch. You two want me to drive you to an unsupervised house party? Good! I'm glad you guys are having some fun before graduation. I don't want you guys to make the same mistake I did. I spent the majority of my 20s overcompensating for the fact that I never had fun in high school. I went crazy. You know I'm banned from Jamba Juice? Every Jamba Juice. That came down from corporate. I had a friend that she was banned from Urban Outfitters because she was f***ing in the dressing room. I should've gone. I was like, girl, really? Really, bitch? You couldn't get a motel? A hotel no-tell? Well, she didn't technically have sex. She was starting to get head. It wasn't actually sick, but it was precursor, so she was banned. Banned in high school. I mean, he is fine, bitch. Just like, what? The hell is this La La Land? rubbing alcohol, there's nothing strong enough. What is going on? No. Come here. How? Come on, go downstairs. This stuff is like herpes. I'm so stoked you're here, dude. Thanks. I've always wanted you to come out. Oh, I, I am out. I came out in the 10th grade. <laughs> no. <laughs> I didn't like come out and hang out on the weekend. Not Diana Ross coming out, bitch. Do you want to go do karaoke in the guest room? I yeah. love that girl. Yeah. The song goes out to my cast. <clears throat> I love karaoke, but I'm like very specific. Like for me, I like songs that remind me of my childhood, like songs that I would sing and dance with my grandma. Come girl, I'm trying to get your pussy wet. Wait a minute. It's not fair. Come on, Linus. Yo, 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 I don't know. Oh like, no, too much flick. Like, whew. See, well, that's easy for you to say <laughs> when you're like three feet taller, right? I'm looking straight down at it. How tall are you? How tall do you think I am? You better stop flirting with this before I sit on your face. I'm gonna go take care of them, make sure they don't kill themselves. But hey, you stay right here, yeah? Yeah. Okay, you don't move. I'll come back a moment. Okay, don't move. I'm not right? Gonna move. Don't move. I'm not gonna yeah? move. Don't you fucking move. I'm Tony Montana, okay? <laughs> oh dear. Come on, body. She's just lying dead at the bottom of the pool. Too dark. Okay, I'm sorry. I always wanted to have that romantic moment at a pool and just like, uh And by romantic, I mean like that pool scene from Showgirls. Oh, oh, shit, I'm sorry. Oh. Oh, that hurts. Mm, I've been there, girl. You have crushes on these guys and then you just build up this whole fantasy into your mind and then you find out that they have wife, kids. Ugh. And also that they're your uncle, but that's a different story. What? Things are going so well over here, like really, really, really well. I'm being so mean to him, but it's working. Girl. This actually oh, might No, happen. Molly, please, I'm asking you. Let's just go. Great. Malala. You mean no. Wait a minute, she did it when you did it. No, I'm not leaving just because you're doing the thing that you always do. What? If I didn't drag you to do things, Amy, you just you wouldn't do that. You, you, you don't drag me. You, you force me to do whatever you want to do. You never take charge. I always have to push you. Without me, you wouldn't do anything. Oh my I'm Lord. going to Africa without you. Yeah, I encourage your summer abroad. I'm not going for the summer. I'm going for the entire year. Oh. <laughs> You're 
Coward You're me. selfish and me. You're a bad friend. You're a bad friend. Okay, ladies, let's stop before we say something we're gonna regret. Like, you are a badass who takes no prisoners and cries in the bathroom at parties. Why are you so cruel? I just don't like meek people. You don't like meek Mill? What? What? You're just a basic hot girl who's gonna peak in high school. She is gorgeous. What is with the women in this movie? Oh! All right, sisters, sisters. Oh, here comes Macklemore. Do people really think I had sex with a prostitute? Sex worker. I'm trying to be politically correct. Well, not like this is the channel for political correctness, but I'm just saying. Yeah, sorry, just uh, just got a little dizzy for a second there. Um, you can stop if you want. <laughs> God, this is so chic having sex in a bathroom in Los Angeles in a vintage home. Ah. Oh. My god, so 60s. Mm, I wish. Yeah, I was always in the bathroom of a McDonald's somewhere where the rats were crawling up. It was always disgusting. But that's none of your business. I'm sorry. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> no. No, 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 bitch. I've had men do a lot of things to me, but throwing up? No, ma'am. That is, I have boundaries. Well, barely, but you know. They're gonna come in here, they're gonna find us. Oh. I am not a coward. All right, focus up. Wait for my signal. I'm gonna create a diversion. What? What is you doing? Ha! Bitch, now this is some white people sh no, ma'am. No. That's that white confidence that I just aspire to be, bitch. Have some black person try me some shit like that. This movie would have ended right here. You know, this is why people say I gave guys roadside assistance, right? I gave them a ride home, that's all. Okay, that's not true. I blew them. But it's not like they ran out of gas and I showed up to suck their d while they waited for help. It makes sense to hook up in a car. I'm not gonna, like, suck a d at my own home where my father can walk in at any moment. Also, I want to enjoy it. Yeah, I heard that. Yeah, I've been there. Well, except it's not my car, but... You know what the worst part is? All the f***ing girls call me that, too. Honey, the girls, the boys, everybody, everybody hates when a woman tries to free herself and be herself, honey. People don't like that. Why? Because we live in a world that hates women. You want to put them in a cage? Oh, what I'm saying? What, what, what did I say? Girl, I don't trust people with glasses like that in the 21st century, honey. Dude, you're in full-on jail. <laughs> yeah, I know. I could never go to prison, honey. A supermodel like me up in prison with those men that haven't seen women in years and pent up sexual tension? <gasps> I am not graduating without you. So either I get arrested and I join you in there, or we go together. Morning, my queen. So last night was amazing. Can I see you again? Good luck at Google next year, okay? Did you f Miss Fine? I mean, she's fine. I never had hot teachers on it. Well, did I have hot teachers? Well, I had, I had this art teacher in high school, bitch. Oh my God. I would have shoved that whole easel up my ass if you wanted to, honey. I, the, the yes. Oh my God. Well. She wanted to change the people's perception of these bitches, so hey, now that's how you make an entrance, bitch. <laughs> Wait, you still have a little vomit. Oh. oh my lord. We have a lot more to learn. Because this part's over. Oh. And that's so sad. It was great, wasn't it? <laughs> They're never gonna be the same, but it was perfect. You didn't want to see me in my high school graduation. I was literally, when I went up to walk to get my diploma, I literally broke. My mom had to come to the stage and get me because I literally broke. I'm not even joking, but I'm not. Jo I swear, I was a. Me my mom had to come and literally get me because she was like, "Bitch." No, don't be the drama queen right now. Well, you know, I always have to steal the moment. But I was, oh my god, I was a mess. I figured I'd bring back their clothes. I don't usually leave my 
underwear in, in places that are that aren't my room. That's why I stopped wearing underwear because I always leave them in guys' houses. I ain't going back there. What are, What are you doing for for the summertime? I think I'm gonna backpack around for a bit. Where? Honestly, anywhere I can find a couch to crash on. If you ever end up in in Botswana, you'd have a couch to crash on. Okay. But. Okay. Stunning. St legs, honey. Oh. <laughs> yeah, feels weird to be on this side of the car. It's oh, like this is so sad. I, I, Different. Yeah, I can't believe I'm not gonna see you tomorrow. Call me on that weird international flip phone, okay? Bye. I love Bye. you. Love you. <laughs> I remember when I had to say goodbye to my friends for college. Oh my god, it was so sad. I, I, I couldn't. I can't. I can't. I mean, you're with these people for four years. Even see your, you, you see each other in the summer. Four years. And then to say goodbye. Oh my god, my heart. My own touch goes by. Mm. So slowly can do so much. <laughs> Jesus. I was going through a thing. <laughs> You are a, you're cr <laughs> thing, thing. You wanna get pancakes? Fuck yeah, I do. <laughs> this was cute. This was a cute movie. Like, <laughs> this was fun. Like, this was, you know, there wasn't an emotional toll on me. You know, there was a little, there was a little moment, there was sadness, but nothing crazy, nothing that will, you know, that will take its toll on my emotion and my physical appearance. You know what I mean? Because the last, you know, with Promising Young Woman, we had Gerald's Game. This was a fun movie. This was a good distraction. But next week's film, if you're still with me, is going to be a throwback. I'm going to be watching a movie that I have not seen in over 12 years, 12, 15, no, 13. I don't know. It was, it's definitely over 10, but it's a movie that I've talked about in this channel quite a few times it's gonna be just fun it's gonna be it's, gonna be, it's a silly movie but it's gonna be oh I'm excited, I'm excited. But um, anyways, Queens, this was a fun movie. Thank you for those who recommended the movie. I really appreciate it. This was fun distraction. This was a fun, you know, comedy, very light, not too much. And it's, it's a good movie. This was a nice movie. It was, you know, like a coming of age, very cute. I'm feeling it, I'm feeling it. It was a very cute movie. But anyways, Queens, I hope, I hope, most importantly, you know how to keep it. Arr, so and I'll see you until next time, darlings. Bye.